way. I did not see it there. I was just watching uh, 360 videos with cardboard. Did you mean you were watching a jump video? Yes, that's right. That's great. Have you checked out the jump camera? Let's go see it. Great, let's do it. So here we have our jump camera which is 16 camera modules in a circular arrangement and this allows us to capture stereoscopic 360 video in a way better than ever before. What we do with these 360, uh, what we do with these 16 cameras is we take the video coming from them and put it in our cloud assembler. Our assembler uses thousands of machines and some software magic to create a seamless panorama. That's a panorama without any boundaries, borders. And you, you get to take a look at this in 360 3D, which means near things look near, far things look far, and you can look anywhere just like you normally would if you were actually in a place. And we're using cardboard to look at, at this video through it. And speaking of cardboard, we have our new version here. We have replaced the magnet with a capacitive trigger right here. And now it gives us access to a lot more devices, such as iOS, iPhone devices. And speaking of Jump and Cardboard, what else can we do with it? Uh, with Jump, that's a great question. So I think we're only at the tip of the iceberg as far as possibilities with Jump go. We hope we'll use Jump to capture some of the most beautiful places on Earth. In fact, expeditions, which is a way for school children to go on field trips while sitting in their classrooms through the help of VR, um, is using some Jump content to go to really interesting and educational places. That's awesome. You know what I'd like? I'd love if a class could study Mars, for example, using 360 videos. Yeah, we need to figure out how to get this thing to Mars. <laughs> but if you're a developer, then check out our website. We have released a new UX library, a, a new UX application, so you can see our best practices for designing for VR. Thank you for watching us from I.O.